Hey, I'm Dorian, joined by my wife and celebrity menswear stylist, Ashley Weston. Hey guys. So today, fellas, it's 2020, it's a new year, new decade. It's time to talk about your accessories. We already talked about the general essentials you should have. We'll link that video in the description below. But now it's time to get to these little finer little yep. things that every man should have in 2020 and beyond. Let's get into it. But before we get into that, we have a question for you. Ooh. Inquiring minds want to know, specifically these two, <laughs> what are your essential accessories this year? Leave it in the comments section below. So first up on the list is a backpack or a briefcase. So you wanna go with the briefcase if you work in a more formal business setting, you can have one with a shoulder strap. However, if you are wearing a suit, do not use the shoulder strap because it will ruin the shoulders of your suit jacket. The padding in your shoulders, yes. yeah, right? But a backpack's great if you don't work in a more formal business setting. For sure. And the next thing on the list is near and dear to my heart. I'm a bit of a nerd for them, as they say, and so much so that I made my wife wear one. It's a watch, <laughs> either a dress, neither of these, or a casual watch. Just depends on a couple different things, right, Ash? Yeah. So a dress watch is great for a suit if you wear suits more often. Casual watch if you're wearing more, you know, casual outfits what about? or semi-formal outfits. You know, whichever one just depends on your preference. And it's just a great way to imbue some of your personality into your outfits. And the next one, I would argue, basically everyone needs at yes. this point in their life because whether you're going on just a quick little trip away for the weekend to visit friends or family, or you're going on maybe in more of an extended trip or for business, then you definitely need a piece of carry-on luggage. And this is brought to you by today's sponsor, Carl Friedrich. I was very surprised actually to see them come out with a piece of luggage because they're more known for their leather goods. You'll notice their luggage has an extra little, just cool stylish touch. I've never actually seen it before where it has a little leather band around it and the handle's leather and it comes in a couple different colors, cognac, black or chocolate. It has TSA approved locks, which are very good. And I love their combination locks too. And it has 360 glide Japanese wheels on it. It has an optional power bank built into the luggage, which comes in crazy handy for someone like Ash. Now the feature that I absolutely love is the lifetime warranty on this luggage. It's a big one. The fact that this has a lifetime warranty means that I can trust the durability and construction of this piece. And if I have, you know, any kind of problems, no problem. They'll help fix anything I have and make sure that it is perfect. The other thing I really like as well is that you can actually get it monogrammed for yourself or if you're giving as a gift, that would be fantastic. Nice personalization touch that you don't really see on this type of luggage, just carry on type of luggage anywhere else. And on top of that, we've got an offer code for you guys. It's in the description below. <laughs> Check it out so you get a discount. It's a limited time discount. So you better act quick because we always get complaints and people are like, oh, well, this is out of stock or how come it's this much now? It's like, hey, hey, I'm sorry. <laughs> we can't force you to buy it. So just take care of it. You will thank yourself. And Ash, what essentials video would be complete without some sort of headphones being mentioned? Yay. <laughs> you can do over ears, you can do in ears. Wireless is kind of king right now. It's really hard to do wired headphones these days because there's so many good wireless options out there. So just grab a pair. We'll link some of our favorites. Obviously we kind of maybe own some. <laughs> so we'll list them in the description below. And for this next point, we did a long exhaustive oh, video good. about this. It was a couple years ago. A lot of it still holds up, so you should definitely check it out. We'll link it in the description below, but it is a wallet. But a slim, slim wallet. Slim wallet. Five-fold <laughs> card case. There's a lot of amazing options. We definitely need to do an update, I think, to that wallet video yeah. because there have been, we'll call it some innovations in the wallet industry. So. But the one feature that has not changed all these years is the fact that you want something that is super slim. And classy looking and kind of minimalist. Leather, ideally, you can get alternate leathers as well, but you wanna make sure it is slim because no one wants to carry a brick in their back pocket or front pocket. And while we're on the topic of things in your pockets, you gotta have a slim, classy kind of phone case. We're rocking the clear ones. Yep. You can get colored ones. Minimal is gonna be key unless you have a very specific reason for keeping your phone in a massive otter box so it looks like an old school brick <laughs> phone. You don't wanna do that if you can help it. Cause if you're trying to be a stylish guy, you definitely wanna make sure that, you know, the thing that's on you at all times of the day is also kind of <laughs> cool and stylish looking. So a great way to add some personality to your outfit is through your socks. So that's why I always recommend having 
as much fun as you possibly want when it comes to your socks. Obviously, you can you know pick up some solid colors as well, yeah. but a little peek of something fun can be a great conversation starter and also just something that will make you kind of crack up inside when you know you're wearing some funny ones. And we talked about the next item earlier in the video, but this is an addition to that. This is a way to add even more of your personality into your outfit, and that is with some alternate watch straps. Got two Perlon straps here. Notice you just have a regular black. Then you can have like a different like gray color, but with a little pattern in it. You can also get canvas. You can get obviously leather straps outside of that, but it's just a really cool way to add just a little something extra to your outfit. Your life will not be complete without some sort of insulated coffee mug or water bottle, <laughs> because if you put something that's hot in it, it will come out the exact same temperature. <laughs> Hours later, I've been driving, throw back some coffee that I think has cooled down and spit it all over the dashboard. Don't be like me. But when you put ice in there and you leave for the day and come back, there's still ice in there. And this next item, we've talked about, I think a number of times over the years because I'm a personal user of it. I cannot recommend it enough. I do love it. It comes in handy way more than I ever thought it would. And that is a keychain sized Leatherman. This is the Squirt P4 comes in a bunch of different colors. This thing has been through the ends of the earth and back with me, and I am so glad I have it with me every single time someone goes, oh, does anyone have a, yes, I do. <laughs> it's on my keychain. Okay, so this next one, it doesn't matter where you live, you're going to eventually have to step outside God, into right the sun. Here. And you want a stylish pair of sunglasses. You don't say, yeah. I feel like sunglasses can really make or break an outfit, yep. especially if they're the wrong choice for you. So pick up a stylish pair and make sure it complements your face shape. It's time for the next one. Yes, All right, next fellas, one is. We're gonna learn a lot about me today. No, we don't need to see this. Oh. Okay, we're gonna be talking about boxer briefs, but I don't need you, to, everyone knows what oh. they look like. I don't need you to model them. I'm demonstrating, you know, the sunglasses. I'm like, come on, the guys I need understand. to know. Yes, so it doesn't matter how old you are, no need for your boxers or for briefs or white, any kind of white underwear Tidy situation. <laughs> yes. Let's step Be up the game, guys. Be a grown man and a gentleman and pick up some sexy black boxer briefs. And the next two items kind of go hand in hand. You can't really have one without the other. No. Right? <laughs> Agreed. We've been talking about these since we're blue in the face for years and years now, and that is, number one, a tie bar. Yes. It is that little extra touch where you separate the stylish men from the stylish boys. <laughs> and also, obviously, you want a nice tie to go with that because it'd be a little weird clipping that to your t-shirt. Yeah, so with regards to the tie, you want a black and navy textured tie, I would say, instead of going with just like a solid satin tie, which just looks very conservative and stuffy and very dated. So instead, you want something with a little bit of texture to it. And kind of on that same tip, I think, Ash, speaking of tip, you want to get a white pocket square with some kind of colored tipping on it. Yes. You can have a plain white one, nothing wrong with that either, but you wanna add just that little extra touch with the tipping, that's the coloring on the top, and it comes in a thousand different colors, <laughs> so you can choose whatever you like. It's just an extra little thing, just like a tie bar, that just kind of puts it a little bit over that every stylish guy should have. Oof, Ash, it's a little cold in here. It is a little cold, which is why <sighs> one of the accessories you should definitely own oh. is a scarf. No way. Fancy that. What a coincidence. If you're more of a classic person, definitely stick with solid colors like camel, black, or charcoal. If you like to have a little bit more fun, add some patterns like this, or even just some more brighter, fun colors as well. I think that with scarves, they're like your socks. You can get away with having a little bit more fun with them. And next up, calls back a little bit to a couple different things. It's definitely you need this if you're gonna be traveling kind of anywhere. I would even say just for like a night somewhere because if you're a watch guy, then you definitely need to have a travel watch case. I love this one, A, because it looks like a <laughs> hockey puck. It does. But it's actually a hard case and it's pretty darn cheap. So definitely grab one of these. This comes in handy way more than I ever thought it would. There are some days maybe you just don't wanna do your hair or maybe you just wanna hide from someone. So that's why <laughs> you should always have a baseball cap. I don't know if I'd wear a baseball cap to hide from anyone. <laughs> Who are you? What'd you do with my wife? I don't know if it quite works that way, but I can tell you, definitely those lazy Sundays need to run out and you're like, I'm not gonna do my hair, but it looks like pure crap. 
pop on a cap, you're good to go. It's great for that type of situation. And it creates, you know, a little bit sporty of a look if that's what you're going for as well. So definitely need to grab a baseball cap. This next item is great if you are going to the gym or you do any sort of traveling. That is a dop kit. You want to keep your toiletry items organized and the only way to do that is to own one of these guys. No, you can have just a trash bag or a grocery bag or a little <laughs> plastic Ziploc bag. I used to no. do that before I kind of grew up a little bit and went, eh, maybe that's not the most stylish thing to have. Absolutely So not. <laughs> if you're a stylish gentleman or you were trying to up your style game in 2020, you definitely want to get a stylish top kit. So okay, Ash. That's it. That's it. Those are the top accessories for 2020 and really beyond. <laughs> All right, guys. We'll see you in the next one. Bye.